hide by default plane insert new geometrical set give the name for it create a point for creating the origin for the part take a axis system give the point of this for the making the origin insert new body for sketching select the axis for the sketch start sketching as per the dimensions and as per the geometry give the values and make it fully constrained delete extra bodies for uh, sketches get correct set the 5 and this is uh, 200 with the full so it's a uh, 100 value so apply the flits so 60 so these are the 25 take the tab button for the giving the values for the radiuses it's 30 so 25 and it's also 25 create the circle for making the holes so 12.5 with the radius extrude it more than your maximum height insert new body sketch on axis sketch here for the cutting your extra material Create a sketch as per the inputs. Give the dimensions. Give the fillets. So forty. It's 
also and the remaining is 30 and 30. Extrude it with the thickness. Hide both the bodies, insert new body, we have the common sketch for this and the new one, so we can take it again, create a plane for sketching, generate a plane, sketch on it. Then give the value for the circle, it's a 10. Create a rib. Uh, the sketch and the profile is already selected. Now we can select the path. This is the curve. So we have done it. Now we have these three bodies. Make the defined part body. Add the body first, which is the main. Remove the body three. Now the body four. We can remove it from it, give the radiuses, so here it is uh, 1 mm, but here we have it is uh, 3 mm. Now we can shell it, just select the top face, side faces, all faces and press ok. We can check, we got the part with the proper thickness and the value and we check what we give the value, it is a 2mm. So now 